Besides speaking exam, your examiner number is 54326 and candidate number is 92174. What is your full name, please? My full name is Kesar Ekanula and you can call me Kesar. Okay. May I see your ID card, please? Yes, why not? Sure. Oh, thank you. Where are you from? I'm from Pakistan. But basically, I am living in Islamabad, but my hometown is Peshawar. Do you work as study? I have recently graduated from Naman University in Peshawar and I have done B.S. English Literature plus FSI in English. Okay. What helps you the most at work? It has changed my behavior. Like before B.S. English, I was not like that. But when I have done B.S. English, now I am totally changed and I saw a lot of changes in myself. Okay. What time do you go to bed? I often go to bed at 11 p.m. or 10 p.m. You know that this is a technological uh, era and uh, most of the people sleep very late, like 11 p.m., 12 p.m. and 1 p.m. Okay. How do you usually start your day? I usually start my day with breakfast because when I am not good, I cannot do any work. That's why I think that the breakfast is an indispensable requirement if you want to spend your day, your day good. All right. How do you like to spend your holidays? I like to spend holidays like I want to earn money and I want to go for traveling. So traveling is the best option if you are free and uh, you should go for traveling like beautiful places like Maldives, Mountain, etc. Do you spend your weekends the same way? Yes, I spend. I often spend my weekend in the same way, but I often uh, spend my weekend with my. Uh, I hang you know, uh, with my friend and I often play football or cricket matches. We arrange some cricket matches on every weekend. Alright. Now coming towards Q card. Okay, the Q card question is talk about an invention you love that has become a part of everyday life. Talk about an invention you love that has become a part of everyday life. Tell me what it is, why you like it, how it helps people. Okay, the pan and card will get prepared for a minute. Yes. Done. Okay. Your dance starts now. Okay, nowadays if we see that this is technological uh, era and uh, uh, whenever I have problem, like whenever I don't know anything, so I go for the YouTube and I search uh, the topic and uh, like I watch different kind of uh, videos, especially from Indian website. And apart from this, I also use ChatGPT and YouTube. These are two. They are just like a teacher. You can easily find any topic and and you can easily uh, like uh, gain knowledge from such website. Like in YouTube, if you search any topic. It is a uh, very good way. Okay. Thank you. You can return your marker and card, please. Alright. Yes. Coming towards the discussion part, do you think inventions make people lazy? Of course, invention has made the people lazy. Why? Because everything is available easily. Like if we uh, enlightened on the past, in past people used to work very hard and they put their effort in every work but nowadays everything is available easily you just uh, you can uh, buy food online you can buy everything online so that's why people are become sluggish to what extent should people use them i think they should use according to their needs and their living if it do, if, like excess of everything is bad if, we, if they use for a lot uh, for a long time it will become harmful to their mental health, especially it affects on our mental health, not physical but mentally we are affected, but we don't know that. Okay. In what way are inventions affecting people? Like I have already told you that they are mentally uh, affecting our brain. Like mentally we are weak, we are also physically weak. If you are mentally weak, you also become physically weak. So that's why I am not in favor of social media so much. Okay. The last question, do you think that is that in certain fields, 
invention should do the work that people used to do. Would you like to repeat your question? Sure. Do you think that in certain fields, inventions should do the work that people used to do? Yeah, if, we, if people are using, uh, if people use social media media for positive things, so it's okay. But if they are, if they use for negative things, it becomes like very harmful for them. So we should use it for positive way. Sure. Thank you. Oh, I understand.